Beauty Academy. Um, I get asked a lot of questions about electric files and a lot of people um, can't afford the industry standard which is the, the Cupta uh, 200 which is around about £350 and that's quite expensive so the questions I get asked is what is a good electric file, what can I recommend as a cheaper version? Well this one here which is off eBay and it's the JD700 this one I can recommend and it is only £60 at the time of making this video it's a really nice electric file so let's go have a look at this one this particular electric file has a, a lot of features on it which are also on the uh, Cup to 200 file with your handset, what's really important is that it has this locking mechanism to actually lock, open and close the chuck. So when you put the, um, the bit into it, it locks tight so it, it doesn't move. It's not a push and pull clutch which gradually can wear with time. So you want to make sure that uh, you get a file that's got this locking mechanism on the chuck. Another thing that's very important is the speed control which you see here. Now the speed control on some of the cheaper models quite often um, you've got very little control in the slow end of the actual um, speed of the uh, rotating uh, drill bit. Now you're never going to use them at full speed but you do want to be able to control it down at the lower end. This one has that feature, which is brilliant. You can you switch it on here, and then you can go right up to a quite a fast speed. But it's at this lower end that it's most important, particularly when you're filing the natural nail. You want to be able to make sure that it's running at a slow speed so there's no damage to the actual nail. This is your on off switch here, so you've got a switch in the middle there. You can plug a foot switch in which, in, which actually comes with the machine to actually control the speed of the rotation. I don't recommend that you use it, but some people do, but um, so I always set it by hand, so I never have the foot switch plugged in and then you just flick it down to this bottom uh, uh, setting when you're using the foot switch. So you've got foot switch off and when you're using it on the hand adjustment here. You've got forward and reverse here, well forward and reverse as most of you will know forward is for right handed people, reverse is for left handed people but there are some instances where even a right handed person may use it on reverse. It comes with a little um, platform there which you can rest your e-file on and it's a good idea if you're going to leave it on top like this to just get some blue tack and just fix it down so that it doesn't fall off and then you damage your handset. The actual machine itself does actually come with a few drill bits and these are of the diamond type which are mainly for doing Russian manicure so you've got three little drill bits there for doing your Russian manicures if you're actually uh, using it, the electric file for that now with an electric file you will need to buy quality drill bits these are carbide and we've got a coarse one here and we've got a fine one. The fine one I use more than anything for actually shaping the nails on when I've done the acrylic over the top and the rough one I use, or coarse one, I use that for thinning out um, the acrylic before soak off or removing gel polish off an acrylic before an infill. So I really only have these two and the sanding band here which it, the machine actually comes with one of these 
um, but you will need to buy some uh, sanding bands. And I like these ones which are made by Medical and these have like a chalky look to them but they are fine grit so that's 240 or higher. So we never use a uh, more than a, a fine sanding band on the natural nail and we have it on the slowest speed possible. Um, if you're if it stops when you touch the nail then you need, just need to speed it up a little bit. But you've got this control, very precise control on the lower end. So this machine I can recommend, it's very good quality and I would suggest that you look at this one if you can't afford the more expensive machines. It's only £60 uh, on eBay and um, they're nearly always in stock. Well, that's that for now. So um, let's hope that you get yourself sorted out if you are looking for an, an e-file. Um, you really don't need to spend in any more money than this. This one's absolutely brilliant. Um, and if you want to know more about our e-file courses, then uh, please uh, leave a message below or, or just contact us on the number shown on this video. And um, I will uh, kind of be glad to see you at our centre. So this is John saying goodbye for now. See you on the next video. Bye for now.